Yeah, we should tell these folks where they're at because they can get to it easy. You know what I mean? There's one there and there's one right over here. But you can probably get to that one pretty easy too. And yours, I can see, you might need to go a little deeper too. Okay. Yeah. I think that's you I see right there. There, you're right there now, you just dropped. You're right in the middle of them. There you go. Hey guys, welcome back to In It For The One At Fishing. This episode is going to be in two parts. I tried to fit it all in one video, but it ended up being way too long. And I wanted to capture this first part of the video separately. Uh, I know a lot of times when you go out on the water, I don't know about you guys that fish a lot, but when you end up fishing docks, it can be hit or miss. Uh, you can run into dock owners or uh, marina owners that really don't want you casting next to the boat, which is under understandable because uh, I know not everybody is as careful as some of us are and they might be bouncing baits off boats and things. So I can understand uh, if you're messing with other people's property and hitting it, you really shouldn't be there. Um, so it can be hit or miss sometimes when you're fishing these docks. Sometimes people will come out and try to run you off. Uh, my experience, for the most part, has usually been pretty positive. I always try to be kind and pleasant and, and respectful when I'm out on the water. And uh, in this episode, we end up sharing the water with some campers that fish here all the time. And uh, one thing you gotta understand, this is their home waters that they fish more often. They camp there, they're, they're seasonal campers. And so, um, it's nice when you can share the water. And so uh, these ladies come and join us. We're already out there fishing and uh, they come down and uh, we just fish and share the water together and have a great time fishing with strangers. And guys, that is what crappie fishing is all about. Now, I know a lot of people like to uh, keep things tight to the chest. They don't like to share information or share, especially uh, uh, locations and things. Uh, and I don't know if you've noticed in my videos, I don't hide spots. I don't hide anything. I share exactly what I'm catching them on, uh, what I'm doing, because that is what, to me, and those I fish with, Shannon Tyre, that's what crappie fishing is all about. It's about sharing information, sharing the waters, and sharing those resources. So um, this uh, part of the episode uh, was really special. And Shannon and I have talked about this a lot afterwards, that this was a, a, just a great time and really symbolize what crappie fishing is all about. This whole trip, really, because later on in the next episode, you'll see uh, we take those crappie, uh, end up catching 73 total with 30 keepers, and we end up taking those to Kenny and Susan's house. They live out in this area, and we uh, clean them up and fry them on their dock and have some crappie sandwiches. And we spend about three hours on their dock just talking. And uh, guys, crappie fishing is all about uh, sharing those memories sharing the resources and information and uh, having a great time. So stick around, we're gonna get to it. Another horrible day on the water. Herb. Today's office space. There we go. Oh, yeah. There we go. Turbo right there. He came to the top one. Better now. Well, we ain't starving. <clears throat> too late. What are you doing? I ate the carcass that's left. Alrighty. You got a measure? You want me to measure these things? 
I mean, I know he's. I know he's more than ten. Fish to see if it's ten. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to see if he's twelve and a half. Right on the dot. All right. Looks like good fish. Think on that. That one right there looks good, don't it? That one. See it there? Yeah. I don't believe you'll keep Just what I think. I mean, a lot of people say there's more on the belly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I caught one right the top, 15 foot. That ain't mud on the belly, people. <laughs> <laughs> that, 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 that ain't mud. Double. Here's keeper. Oh, hey, we do have a double. Mine's bigger than yours, but you know, I mean, we can still call it a double. Or guess. Double river, I think. <laughs> <laughs> if I try not to hook my own daggone finger here. I've got two little ones, you got two keepers. There's something wrong with this piece. That's man. I just want to see what it is. Where's the shine? Probably 12 inches. 12 inch fish. Well, you know, 12 and a half, 12. I got a 12 and a half in here, then another 12. I like to keep them in that foot range. I hate measuring in inches, I just seem to do it in feet. Did I tell you about them two I caught yesterday that added up 31 inches? <laughs> <laughs> no, I don't think you mentioned curious, that huh? today. <laughs> Not mentioned that in 30 minutes. <laughs> What'd you say? I thought Maribel was good. That come right up to it as soon as I turn. Um, hold on. That is, it looks like, uh, oh, let me get this keeper in real quick. Ooh, ooh, touched it. <laughs> it don't matter to me, it's your sandwich. I'll catch my own eventually. <laughs> yeah, he's a keeper. Oh god dang. Excuse me. I'm getting away there. Come here. <laughs> Quick curl run seat. I uh <clears throat> He's fat, man. He got a fatty. Boy, he barely ticked it too. He's a you gonna go 13 I think yeah 13 actually he's under 13 little bitty baby he's just wide that little bitty thing <clears throat> well with the uh, three I put in here plus this one and the ones that Shannon put in here that makes four Get that one. Oh, there he is. Got that one. Got it on camera. Yep. Was it? We are right there where you're at. I don't see you. Anymore, but Remember out there about that far away. Yeah. There you are. There's fish all over you. Right there come dang says line. Oh, are you gonna catch some? They're just staring at you. Hmm. Huh. 
was going back over there. Oh, like that. See no, wait, 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 wait. You just pulled one up. Nope. <clears throat> see what? <laughs> the hammer jammer just rocked my world. Yep. Yeah. You both get down in there. Yeah, I'm just trying not to. Oh. I was trying to see if I can. You know, I have to practice before I turn the bell over. Got him. Baby. Look at them babies. But here's the thing. I'm looking at these marks and I see bigger marks out there because I watched which mark this was. Mm -hmm. There's keepers in that pile. I mean, obviously since I, I've been catching them. This is my first throwback. Golly. I'm ready to leave. <laughs> we should tell these folks where they're at because they can get to it easy. You know what I mean? He might keep. I don't know. I don't know. Yep. Yeah. yeah. There's one there and there's one right over here. But you can probably get to that one pretty easy too. They seem to be under this pontoon and that pontoon shadow. Yeah. Opinion. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Got to take him in for a second opinion. <laughs> That's a clicker. I've always heard that campground crappie is a little bit more lenient with size. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, see, look at there. He's a little bit small. He's catching them all around me. Yeah, but they're right. I mean, they're right. All the way right through there. Yeah. Yeah. I'm catching them off minnows and the jigs too. I'm watching him catch them on minnows. <laughs> There's some. I was about to tell him, I said, there's almost too much brush around here. You can't pick spot fish. Good problem to have. There. I, uh, ooh, that's a keeper. We have 14 throwbacks and you keeping track of, yeah, uh, let me check him. Give me a minute. You keep moving my, uh, oh, he's going to be, oh yeah, he's a keeper. Yeah, I'm not used to catching them, you know, at 10. I'm used to them big. All right, that sounds good. He looks good. Yeah, they're biting kind of a lot today, I noticed on some of these. Oh, you're right in the thick of it right there. Got him. Yeah, there, he's got a, on his uh, depth finder, he can see them swimming and everything. And where this is pointing, you can see them. They're right there, hey, all up under. Yeah. Sit on this side. Of the yeah, thing. and cast. Yeah, they're they're I, right I, on the other side. I can see over there. There's not as much. If y'all get right there on this side, that's, there's a whole big pile of. And I can see. Uh, oh, that's, that's a good. One. One right there, 
I might keep. That's definitely a keep. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Just barely, right? <laughs> And yours, like, I can see you might need to go a little deeper too. Me? Yeah. I think that's you I see right there. There. You're right there now. You just dropped. You're right in the middle of them. There you go. Thank you. Yeah. Oh. Cool. oh. How far are they from the bottom? Uh. They're right, right at 10. If you drop it to 10, yeah, there you go. That good? Let's see. Sorry, I lost you. Here. Well, here, hold this. Oh, that's Yeah, I saw it. I try to catch mine. Oh, dang it. Me and my big oh, mouth. I Nothing? I didn't say anything. <laughs> I, was just, I was asking for a minute. If you can put them on ice, they'll keep for a couple <clears throat> And I like to bleed mine too when I can. Uh, they gotta be alive when you do it. If you just cut up under their oh, their neck area. Do what? We'll find some man up here to cut up. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I do the same thing. <laughs> yeah, all the time. <laughs> you gonna keep these? No, you can have them. I'll take a couple now that you got them filleted. <laughs> I ran a camera. Uh, but I'll cut out anything if you don't want to be on it. Oh. <clears throat> oh my gosh, look at that one. Whoa. Oh, there you go. I make a couple sandwiches right there. Looks like you might go 13 or we got a you got a we got a ruler if you want to measure it. I mean you want a ruler? Ew. I'm gonna step out if you don't mind. That's a good one. Here, I'll give you this too. That way, if I put it on there, you can watch yourself catch it. Um, I don't know if you watch YouTube or not. Yeah, occasionally. Thirteen. Yeah. Thirteen incher. Don't lose that one. I know. There you go. Here, I thought if you want to watch. If you, uh, if I, I don't know how long it'll take me to edit this video, but We're gonna be down I'll put it in there. So. All right. I'll put it right, right there. <clears throat> All right, guys, that's it for this episode. Stay tuned for the next one when we take these crappie and fry them up, make some crappie sandwiches with Kenny and Susan, and just share some more memories uh, with like minded folks and just have a good time. So, till next time, guys, keep chasing that limit. <laughs>